Thank you, Heath, for coming over today. And welcome to our 1910 work in progress. There's a lot of quirks to this house, like this fireplace, that we're just having a tough time really figuring out. Sure. This was one of the reasons that I actually wanted to buy the house. Came in, it had a um, brick cover over it. And then when I came down and I felt around it, removed it. Oh really. yeah, look at that, it's actually wood. Yeah, so we're thinking of doing a gas insert, mm -hmm. but with the clearance with the houses being so close together, it wasn't an option. So I was okay. thinking maybe electric, but it's been really hard to try to find a size that would fit in this box. Sure, well it's a little bit of an unconventional opening in that size, but with the electric fireplaces where they come in fairly standard sizes, I think we can make some adjustments and make something work. Let me just grab some tools and we'll get to work. Great, awesome. All right, Brian, so this is a unit I found that's gonna fit into this space that we're mm -hmm. looking for. Uh, the advantage to this particular unit is that it's zero clearance on the sides and back. So we can slide it into the existing wood frame that you have and mm -hmm. not have any safety concerns. Awesome. Uh, it has a lot of good features in this unit. Use this remote control. It'll show the LED screen that simulates flames. Nice. It has embers down bottom that'll glow. And the really great thing that I think you're gonna like is the heater up here. It has a fan forced heater up here that's actually capable of heating the room that we're in. Awesome, I'm usually a miser with a thermostat, so I think my friends are gonna love that. Perfect. On top of that, we have the electrical connection in the back. Uh, the only issue we ran into is looking for the size. We had the width right, mm -hmm. but we couldn't find something that would do the height as well. Mm -hmm. So I have a thought. What do you think about doing a raised hearth to let this sit on it? We'll do something with a little bit of stone and wood, make it look a little natural. Cool, I'm excited, let's go. All right. So I'm making the box out of plywood and an oak face. We're going to use pocket screws to hold the assembly together and that'll support our stone. So before we install the stone top on the base, let's run the wire from the basement up through the bottom of the box and into the back of the unit. Got the wire. All right, that should be good. Cool. All right, the adhesive's all set. Let's get ready to put the stone on. Awesome, I'm loving the stone, where'd you get it? Yeah, it's a great little piece. So a lot of people don't know that if you go to one of your local stone manufacturing yards around the area, a lot of times they have small pieces left over. They're happy to sell, you know, cut it to what you need. You can give them a template or a measurement and get a piece for a reasonable price. That's awesome. All right. That looks fantastic. Now I'll just connect the wire we just ran to the back of the unit. All right, let's put the glass on. All right, everything's tied in in the basement. Would you like to do the honors? Yes, I would, thank you. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, it really looks great. The nice thing about the LED screen broadcasting the flames like that is you can actually change the color so you can go down to more of a blue tint or the yellow. Oh, that's awesome. And the other great feature of this unit is it does have the built-in heater so we can run just a blower, low heat or high heat to kind of help heat the room in the Perfect. winter. Perfect. That'll make everyone happy when they come in. Good to hear. Awesome. All, All right. right. Thank you so much. You really transformed this space. It looks amazing. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project. So be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button to make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.